Hello, my name is Neda Rohani and I am part of Farhang Foundation's Nowruz Committee. Today, I'm here to show you how to make this beautiful Sombol crafts project. First thing you're gonna need to do is visit farhang.org and download the Sombol template and have it printed out on colorful cardstock of your choice. Today, I've chosen this gorgeous turquoise. Next, you're gonna need colorful tissue paper cut into two by two inch squares. I have a few of my favorite colored markers, some craft glue, and now we're just gonna start. First thing I'm gonna do is color in the leaves of the symbol. I've chosen green, but you could choose whatever color you like. Symbols come in all different colors. They come in magenta, pink, lavender, purple, and if you go outside the lines, that's absolutely fine. But if you can, try and stay inside. Now I'm gonna do a contrasting color and try to emulate this pattern. But you could do whatever you want. Let's do like a little Missoni. This one's gonna be some wavy lines. And then this is gonna be straight lines. Now for the flower part, I'm just gonna do swirls. And I chose magenta today, but you could choose whatever color you want. So you just go in a little circle like this. I'm just making little spirals. Now this is just the background. Keep in mind that you're going to glue tissue papers on top of this, so it doesn't have to be perfect. Sombol is one of the seven S's in the traditional have seen display, and it symbolizes spring. Now we're done with this part. Here comes the fun part. We're gonna crinkle these two by two tissue papers into little balls. I'm just gonna grab this purple one and just make it into a little ball, okay? I'm gonna make up little piles. You can make these all the same color or you could use multiple. I'm going to do a gradient. I've decided to do a gradual color change from dark purple to light pink. And now we're ready to glue. Grab your craft glue, grab one of your balls, put a dot of glue, and press it firmly down on your sombol flower. Just keep in mind you could do it in any color that you like. I just happen to do it in this gradient format. Don't use too much glue, because then it'll get all over your beautiful drawing. This project is a great idea as greeting cards for your parents or grandparents for Noruz. I'm sure they would love to receive this from you. You will need at least 30 crinkled up tissue papers, but you could do more if you like and pack it in. Now that this is all finished, I decided that I'm going to give it to my parents as a Noruz card. I'm gonna sign it with one of my markers. There you go, we're all done. Here we have our completed beautiful Sombol project, perfect for the half scene table or to give as a gift to your loved ones. Wishing you all a very happy Noruz.